Hey guys, welcome back to the channel once again, Kenroy here. Now in today's video, Sophia and I, along with Naomi and Abigail, will be tidying up our house after our ground floor renovation project. Now the kitchen's finally done, and so is the living room, and now it's time for us to get to cleaning. If you're new to this channel guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, as well as click that little bell notification, so as soon as we upload a new video, you'll be notified. Now this is just a quick video to show you what we've been getting up to and I hope that in an upcoming video guys we'll be able to give you guys a full tour of what we were able to achieve in our ground floor renovation project. Building work has been done, and we're literally now just. Why are you climbing out? I'm fine. Is that how you get out of your high chair? Okay, come on. Like I was saying, all the building work is now done, and now is the fun part when we have to actually pack everything back into the house. And yeah, we're not looking forward to that. But I've brought most of the stuff back in from the garage and we're going to do a tidy up. First things first is figuring out what we're going to keep, what we're going to get rid of. I stuck the wind. I'm only joking, I'm not getting rid of you guys. Not yet anyway, because it's not yet legal. But so we need to get everything sorted. There's a few snags that I still need to do, um, like sort out that light switch over there. Attach these beads just here to the door frame to hide and to conceal the creases. A few bits of painting here and there. As you can see, a lot of boxes have now come back into the house and uh, yeah, they need to go somewhere. So most of this stuff is gonna live in these cupboards here, which is what we're gonna have to try and sort out. Safari so and I are going to have to try and go through them and sort them out at some point. Maybe later on we can get started once the kids go to bed. Uh, but yeah, hopefully we'll be able to fit most of this. I mean all of this stuff here belongs to this person. And the rest of stuff is so really. Yeah, so I think you need to get a new house Naomi. I think that's the only way we're going to cope. You're talking too much. Well, I think we've got there enough go. stuff to start our own party business. That's all arts and crafts, decoration, toys, board games, you name it. But at least for now, everything is done and dusted. The fireplace was the last thing to be completed today. I put the actual housing back on the fireplace to surround. Everything is still dusty, as you can see. X marks the spot. But first things first, we need to get everything packed away, then we can have a proper sweep, a proper hoover, a proper wipe down, and yeah, yeah, the rest is history. The next time you see this place, maybe it will be in a much better position, looking more settled and nice and clean. And more party-like. And more party-like. Tropics. In Jamaica it's raining, yeah, so... Oh, this is the closest to home I'll get. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's not sad at all. <laughs> oh, these poor plants have to endure a lot. Hello, Eddie. Oh. Yeah, that's why I needed you to get the spray bottle for me. So we can wash these plants clean. They're out in the rain. This was the original. <laughs> I don't even know how that leaf is still alive. It looks like someone's been chewing on it. Five years. Because <laughs> we've had it for three years up here. Mm -hmm. It's looking healthy though. So yeah, when you have building works, you end up with a lot of dusty plants. Everything is just dusty. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. We'll get there. Have you got a plan for today, Mr. DIY? Well, I'm waiting for my brother to wake up out of his bed. <laughs> Why are you waiting for him? To come and help me fit the shed together. Ah, oh, yes. Because it's not really a one man job for a six by eight shed, so You're I figured. Well, I'm, I'm no <laughs> Superman. <laughs> well, to be honest, I could I, you probably do it myself, but it's probably uh, not a safe thing to do. Oh, this is the right song, Abby. <laughs> oh no, the music stopped. Did the electrics go? What happened? I can't connect to the Wi-Fi network. You might want to check the connection settings in the Google Home app. Okay. Oh, somebody's plugged it out again. <laughs> what are we gonna do? Because now it's so visible, she keeps messing with the Wi-Fi. Oh, no. We're gonna have to um, figure something out, Abby. You know, we're thinking of getting that plant stand. Might have to get one to put there to kind of hide the switch a bit. Which one are you carrying, Abby? Can you carry a small one? Can you carry this one? Actually, carry this one. Sorry. Hold it. Oh. Mummy can carry the big one. Just about. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at you, big girl. Couldn't even walk up that ramp before. Yeah, you can leave them there. The sun will be up enough to give them a good dose. <laughs> Come on, we're not going to the garden yet. Later. Whoa. Oh, well done for bending your knees. Better than most. Alright, let's clean. Make sure you get in between all those little crevices. Now there you have it guys. Everything has been cleaned from top to bottom. I'm sure we probably missed some spots so we'll probably be going over that in the weeks to come. Now this ground floor renovation project has been a great experience and we're absolutely loving our new kitchen and living room along with all the additional cupboard space especially underneath the stairs. Now like I said we'll be doing a future video showing you from top to bottom a full tour of what we were able to achieve including how much this project actually set us back so please feel free to stick around for that but in order to be notified you guessed it you've got to hit that subscribe button as well as the little bell notification and as soon as we upload a new video you'll be notified as always this is Kenroy and Sophia saying we'll see you when you see us take care